I've got an incredible holiday short rib recipe for you that is so simple. We're gonna make it in our slow cooker. Right here, just some short ribs that I've already seared up and I wanna get the second batch going in my pan. You gotta salt and pepper these, that's all you need for seasoning. Get that in your pan. Browning at first adds great flavor and that's why you wanna give it a quick sear. Season the other side once you put them in the pan. I've got some carrots and some onions going down first. I've picked really hearty root vegetables. I want you to keep your onions together. So take it from the root area, cut it in half, and then cut it in a quarter. And that way they won't fall apart. That's all you need on those. And then my carrots, I'm gonna cut into big pieces. And by the way, if you cut your vegetables too small, they're just going to disintegrate in your slow cooker. And since I wanna serve these on the side, I wanna make them nice and big. Now, I wanna put in there my short ribs. I wanna add to this my parsnips, cut those up. Big chunks, those go on top. These are kinda like carrots, but a bit sweeter. two turnips. Now I've got some thyme in here, rosemary, and I also have the stems from my parsley. That is wrapped up into a little bouquet, a little nosegay of herbs. That's going in here. And now I want to add a beer to this. This is a dark stout beer. Lots of flavor in here. And whenever you're working with a slow cooker, you have to have liquid. Beautiful. Now, I wanna add just enough water so that it comes up right to where the meat is. Now to this. Two things need to go in there. Worcestershire sauce. You just need a tablespoon of that. That is gonna make it rich and delicious. And then I want you to put in a tablespoon of spicy brown mustard. A little bit more salt and just a tad bit more pepper. This is gonna go right into your slow cooker on low. And that is gonna sit there for about six to eight hours and you're gonna have perfection in a slow cooker. Look at that beautiful short rib. And that's why you wanna use a slow cooker. Now your vegetables, you want these to go into the bottom of your platter. And this is exactly why I made those cuts so big. Look at that. Now, put your short ribs on top of your vegetable and you're gonna have some service for your family. And there we go.